Hey everybody, here's the inside of a um, 500 series pedal as I drop it. So that's the 500 series, that's what the buttons look like. It's the same as the RC600 inside. And here's how the mechanism works. It's kind of, it's an interesting way for the button to be pressed. You see how that comes up? So basically the button is, is that thing there and it's held on by this like, this washer clip. I gotta cut on my finger, sorry. Uh, this washer clip right here. So mine, the middle one, the washer clip is gone. I can't find it, it must have come off. So the button was working inconsistently. So I took it apart. I, first I thought I needed to replace the, the button assembly, like there was something wrong with the button. But it's usually the, it's almost always the mechanical parts that fail on these kind of things that you stomp on. So that, that's the part that broke. So what was happening, so that right there, so now this comes off, here I'll show you. This part comes off. Let's see if I can just wiggle it out. I'm trying to do this one-handed. Hold on. All right, hold on. All right, I took it out. It required two hands. Surefire way to break things is film a video on how to fix them and then try to do it with one hand. <laughs> but um, so you can see those retaining clips are important to have. See that there's the retaining clip. There's a smaller one. I don't know the exact size. I just ordered for $6, a set of like 300 of them in various sizes off of Amazon. And I'm hope, hoping, basically just spent $6 and hoping that what shows up is one that is the right size. I'm guessing it's like one millimeter, 1.5 millimeters, something like that, 1.4 millimeters, who knows? Um, but yeah, so that's how it works, it's pretty cool. So I'm gonna put it back in. As you can see here, I'm doing it one-handed again. It just slips on that and it goes in that, and it goes in this little groove. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that little groove? Mm, it's kind of bad lighting, but there's the groove. See the groove on, and see how it's not it's not going up cleanly because of the the washer is not holding the thing in the right place. It's really a strange engineering thing they did over there in, uh, well, it's made in China, but designed in Japan. But see how it lifts the button, and then that just presses this that thing right there that's just a no that's just a normal pcb button sorry this video is crazy and then there's the led it's labeled but that's the button that's basically the button on every pcb ever they all kind of look like that and that's all this assembly is and that doesn't need to be replaced because the button works fine it's just the mechanics but it's good to um open one of these things up and take a look at everything because eventually the Boss RC600 buttons will break because I stomp on them every single night for hours. So I'm glad to be in here and getting myself some of these little washers. They're good to have on hand. Maybe lubricate that little channel that it slides up in. And make sure they're all in there nice and strong. But you can see how it works. It's pretty cool. All right, that's it for today. Maybe I'll update this with uh, it back working again when the washer comes in tomorrow. Okay, we're back, it's the next day. And there is the retaining clip that came in the mail on Amazon. It looks like the one that I got was, was probably the wrong size. It's a little small, but with some force I got it on there and now it's on there and now you can see that it works perfectly. And mate, the thing most of all is that when you, see when you push on this one, it's nice and smooth. See how it goes up nice and smooth? And that one now is also nice and smooth. It was all wobbly and it was inconsistent. So now I'll put it, I'm gonna put the whole thing back together with all the screws and we'll test to see if the button works every single time rather than intermittently. So that was, I ordered that yesterday and it showed up just now, less than 18 hours later for six bucks. I got a whole box full of these retaining clips but you can see it's you can see it's kind of the wrong size i might try to get a different one just in case this one comes off too but a lot of force and it clicked it clicked right on but that's that size and that's that's the that's the boss one you can see it kind of clips around it a little better but that's the one i got if it works it works everything's put back together powered up Let's test it. Are you ready? Is it gonna be sporadic? Sporadic, was it? Let's see. Drum roll, please. 
Amazing, it works. They all work. I have this one set to tempo. Yeah, look at that. So that used to work intermittent, sporadic. Um, and now it works perfectly every time. All right, guys, these are my favorite videos to make more than the performance ones. Yeah, especially when you get something to work. I fixed it. Look at that. Ah, the best. All right, you guys. So if you want to watch live performance looping, subscribe. If you want to see me take more things apart, put them back together, subscribe, like. Please leave your comments in the comment thing at the bottom. Thanks, guys. I will leave a link in the description for the $6 part that fixed it. Ah!